Hey guys, what's up? Buzzed here. And, uh, it's time to set the record straight. Lemon's been talking a lot of shit. And, uh, here we go. It all started a few months ago when I went to Lemon's community grow house in Eschen to farm some tomatoes for the bluegill meals I was making to give away to new players and teach them about cooking. I stumbled across a ledger full of illegal trades, one of them valued at nearly 10,000 USD. And there were many, many documents here showing the same stuff, but not just trades, evidence of murder for hire, character trafficking, illegal moonflower distributions, laced, with a chemical that makes you want to buy more Medivia coins. Kevin the Postmaster sent in the surveillance footage of a Jarks member burning down the grow house and all of the evidence within it before we could get a hands on it. Lemon wants you all to believe that I'm funded by big media and that I own the big media. But the problem is, <clears throat> is that Lemon is the media and he owns big media. Buzz is funded by hard work and profitable hunts that I consistently stream for you guys so that you can learn how to do it too. This guy is the most corrupt tutor that has ever existed. Here's a screenshot of Lemon talking with his also corrupt tutor buddy Fark about the first media company that Lemon ever started. This dates all the way back to Tibiani. Lemon has been the media for the last 12 years. Lemon also owns the Bolivian Times. Look at this display of power abuse in the video called Medivian Times. He frags this innocent player just because he doesn't want to walk around him. Lemon's followers are called the Jarks. What is a Jark? I had no idea, so I looked it up. It's the seal of a counterfeit document. You know these guys are full of corruption and lies. It's right in their name. Their power abuse even extends all the way into Novus. Watch as this normal citizen lady, whose name was concealed for her safety, asks a Jark member to stop KSing her. He tells her to shut the hell up. Lemon wants you to think that I lure people to the Azure mercenary spawn just to get them killed. And while it is true, Mike Wazowski has died in this spawn more than any other druid in the game, I met with him down here right before he started a hunt, and I asked him just how profitable it was. Let's take a look at what he says. So, do you make a profit hunting here? Of course I do, Mike says. How much profit do you make when you hunt here at Azure Mercenaries? Mike says he makes 500k an hour. Easy. Lemon tried to bribe my own teammate to backstab me, and when that didn't work, he hired a hitman over a hundred levels higher than me to come in and assassinate me, not once, but multiple times. He's so corrupt. He said, if the developers don't remove his tutorship within the next week, he's going to start banning top levels every day, starting with the juicers. Here, we watch as Lemon steals boss loot from the community. As if all of this wasn't bad enough, here are some pictures of my home, which Lemon recently stole from me. How did he steal my home? Well, it's simple. He used his tutor power to reduce my premium account by two days so that I would lose it while I was sleeping, giving him time to buy it. I went to Lemon's house to confront him about all of this, which I happened to have given to him for Christmas because I thought we were friends. To my surprise, he had left the door open and I was able to walk right in. After digging around, I found an illegal ledger that hadn't been burned down with the rest of the evidence. What was in this ledger might surprise you. You read the following, written by Lemon. Illegal ledger. Sold some bad shit. 1kk. Stolen loot from last POA hunt. 
6kk. Funds from Saffron, 1kk. Funds from Parcelbook, 100kk. Total recent earnings, 156kk. Jungle.